Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Tammy, if you're new here, and I open subscription boxes. I have a variety of subscription boxes to choose from, so you can head on over to my channel and check out my different video playlists. Today, I have for us BarkBox, the Super Chewer version. BarkBox is um, $35 a month for their straight up basic uh, birth box. You, when you sign up, you put in your dog's birthday, if you know it. You put in the size of your dog, and I get ours for Colt, which is a boxer, and so he would be in the large, um, large to extra large category, depending on the weight that they have, and then we share the treats with Jules, our other dog, who is like a little 10 pound terrier so you know get them for the big dog and they work for the little dog most often so for our bark box for September yeah so for our bark box for September let's see what we got Race and Rough. No, Peace and Rough. <clears throat> I couldn't see the letters for the uh, 70s vibe of it. That is awesome. Look at this. So, each box you will get two treats, two bags of treats, two toys, and then a chew bar. And they do, oh my goodness, that is adorable. And they do, um, they will curate your box a little bit towards your pet's needs. So if they have any sort of allergies or they can't do, they can't chew the chew bars, you can trade out different things. Um, this is adorable. This is what I've been holding. So this is our first toy that we have. This is the Hippie Hopper and it has a natural rubber core, faux fur cover, perfect for peanut butter. Ew. I assume peanut butter up here though. Um, spot clean only, so you cannot put this in the dishwasher. It is BPA free. This does have two layers of play. So, play tip. This toy rewards determined chewers with a second toy inside. It does have a squeaker. Which, I imagine is only going to work when it's in the dog's jaws and they're clamping down on it. It has dental scrubbers and it has a vanilla scent. That's not patchouli, we swear. Yes, it does have a very, um, very fresh food-like scent to it that I can smell. It does smell vanilla-y. So, I don't know, that looks kind of like an angry bunny with his mouth there. <laughs> but that's cute. So, see how to play. So this is what the inside, so this is what the inside of the toy will look like. So after they're done with the ripping off all the fuzzy, then on the inside apparently they have little um, ridges for dental scrubbers and you could put peanut butter on there. So that apparently is where the peanut butter comes into play. So that's awesome. So there is a little bunny, Bark Box Bunny. Next up, we have just a hard chew toy. Make Rough Not War is what this one is. And this one is solid nylon, peanut butter scent, dishwasher safe in the top rack, and BPA free. 
It says it is peanut butter scent. I'm only smelling that, but that's alright. So that is what that looks like, and this is a hard, um, hard nylon. So when they chew on this and get little ridges in here, you can just sand it down a little bit and to make it last longer. So there's our little heart toy. And I don't know if this was on purpose or not, but we have two chew bars. We have a, and they're both the same, pumpkin and honey recipe chew bars. Now, my dogs love these. So as a matter of fact, this isn't the first one we've gotten. This one, see how I do it is I break them off in sections and that's their little treat. I have these and their treat bags all through the house. But yeah, so we have two pumpkin and honey recipe chew bars. And since I have one open, I will just take it out and show you what they look like. So that is what those look like. And as you can tell, I've taken some off of there already. Really easy to do. Just bend a little bit off. Jules, come over here. Come over here. She's sitting over here just prancing, waiting for me to do it. Oh. So, jewels. She just wants that. She doesn't care. Okay, Mom, let me down so I can eat. Let me down. So, yeah. So, that is what their chew bars look like. Now, this is what all their chew bars look like. Um, it's just the flavor that's different. Let's put that back down there in its little safe spot. And we have two bags of treats. This month, our treats are jerky bars, turkey recipe, and jerky sticks, lamb recipe. And these are both on the chewier spectrum here. Now their jerky sticks are just long sticks of jerky meat. Super easy for them to chew through and super easy to break apart and use as like a training treat. And here is their jerky bars. These go quick. The dogs love these. Let's see what the rest of the fun things were. Oh, they have a picture of the inside. Okay, so that is what a lifelike picture of the inside of the rabbit looks like. That looks almost dangerous. But cool. Okay, and then they also had a flower that apparently is butter scented. Yes. They have a Peace Buddy, which is rubber and has a squeaker in there. What's this thing? A Lava Champ. Oh, that would have been fun. The Lava Champ is a lava lamp, but that is a treat um, puzzle. So you can put treats in here somehow, and then they have to figure out how to get their treats out. And it is glow in the dark. Oh. Dress up your pup, your pup for wolf stock. Take a picture and share with Super Cheer to introduce your flower fur child. And you can cut out a piece pendant, I think, for their um, collar, maybe. And maybe a flower crown. Yeah. I might have to do that just because that is cute. That's adorable. And then our little pupper models. This is James. He is two years old. This is Gumball and he is 
eight years old. So yeah, James and Gumbo are our two pup models. So yeah, this was a cute little piece and rough bark box for September. Go back to, it says the 60s, but 60s and 70s, I imagine. So that was Colt and Jules's bark box super chewer version for the month of September. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Again, these guys are $35 for their regular bark box and $45 for their super chewer version. They also have a dental subscription and um, they have another subscription and I don't remember which one, what it's called exactly. I don't have my notes with me. Um, but yeah, let me know what you thought of this video and I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day and we'll catch you again next time. Bye, everybody.